Oh yeah, my collection videos. Totally forgot about that. I think you should do a Saucony one. Yeah, let's go. What's good YouTube, Ash Bash back again with another video. If you've been following my channel, I had been doing my collection videos every Monday, but I had to take a bit of a hiatus because I didn't get around to filming it. And this Saucony one is a massive one, so now I've got some free time to quickly get it done. We're getting it done. So enough talking, there's a lot of sneakers to get to. Let's go. Gonna start the video in a sort of order and go with the GRs. Got a pair of random grey Shadow 6000s. Very clean shoe, eBay job, very cheap, love it. Next up is a pair of Shadow 5000s, another GR colorway. This is a pair I got a while ago, super cheap and very, very calm. Now this pair right here was a bit of a sleeper. It was a GR release from Saucony called the Desert Sand, very dope. This one right here is the Grid 8000 model. Very nice shoe, super comfortable in a crazy colorway. Next up is one of my favorite sneakers from my Saucony collection, it's from the Lodge pack, and it is the DXN Camo. These are so dope, so slept on. Seen them on the internet for super cheap as well, so if you like them, check them out. Definitely one of my favorite camo shoes. Next up is another dope pair from the Irish Coffee Pack, the Shadow 6000. These came in three different colors. This one by far was my favorite colorway. Super dope, and the Shadow 6000s are some of the comfiest shoes around. Next up, another GR from Saucony was from the Pumpkin Spice Pack. Super dope again. These are the Saucony Grid SDs, Pumpkin Spice. Love the color blocking, super dope materials. Very guest to have these. Another cool release from Saucony, which was the Shrimp Scampi in the grid on the comfiest shoes. Super fire. So I believe these were called the Shrimp Scampi. Super dope. Got a review on my channel as well. That dope pink and that dope beige. You'll see a theme during this video that they love that sort of beige colorway. It really bangs and it works in color blocking very well. These are up there, mate. Some of my favorites for sure. Next up, we've got another double pack. It was from the Two Scoops pack. I went for the first kicks first, and the next ones came out. I was like, should I get them? And I went for them both and started with the Mint Chop Chip. These are up there, some of my favorites. Super dope colorway, that mint green and the black. It's just so sick. And then we have the strawberry vanilla, which is super pink, some red hits, and then sort of vanilla beige colorway at the back as well. Very dope pack. Now we've got another pack, it's called the beta pack. There were three colorways that came out. I missed out on one of them, which was a yellow colorway. Bit of a wild yellow, so I didn't go for it. I've got two of them, bang. So this is the Coral Pair. Again, shoes that you can get for the super low and they're dope as well. Shadow 6000s, my favorite model, Fire Flames. And we have the Blue Pair. Also Fire, similar colorway. Black with that dope blue, Shadow 6000s. You can't go wrong. Next up, we've got two shoes from the Neon Pack. I believe there were three shoes in the pack completely, but I only went for the two. You can get these for the super low, like under 50 pounds easy, the G9s. So we've got this shoe here in the gray, black with the pink hits. Very dope. And then we have the blue pair with the pink hits and the white midsole, fire, fire. Next up was a very dope, but a bit slept on shoe, which was the Saucony and Saucony Sneaks collab. Fire. These are called Spiral with Saucony. Again, very dope color blocking with the red and the blue and the gold. Fire kicks. Yeah. Next up was a dope, dope collab between Sneakers 76 and Saucony. And these are Super fire. Again, dope color blocking, red, gray, blue. Sneaker 76 always do dope collabs and this might be just their best one. 
in that Shadow 5000 model. Another slept on Saucony sneaker, which is super dope. Probably, I think it was the second sneaker actually ever queued up for. And it is the Saucony Times Anthea. So this is the Jazz colorway. And again, dope color blocking. I think you now see why I love Saucony so much. But yeah, that lovely beige and that dope blue. Super nice suede as well. Came with these two-tone laces as well. Dope, dope, dope pack. Another dope kick is this collab between Saucony and Sneaker Politics. Courageous model, fire. What are we seeing again? Dope color blocking. Beige, that crazy blue, and that sort of yellowy gold. It says Courageous on the side. Politics at the back. Fire shoe, and that red sole as well. Killing them. Next up, we have another dope kick. How many times am I gonna say dope in the same video? Mm. And it is a collab between Extra Butter and Saucony. Going to the movies. Got a review of this on my channel, you can see all the little details and all that. Same for most of the kicks, but these are so fire. The sort of blue you never really see on sneakers. Dopeness with that silver at the back. Extra butter at the back there. Very fire. In this video right here is probably the last Saucony review that I did, it was their collab with Quiet Life. Love these so much. Quiet Lifetime Saucony, that cosmic theme going on. Lovely colours, quite like killed it with this one. Saucony collabs are so fire, the materials are always dope. That's why I love them. Couldn't believe I got these so late and for a dope price. It's the collab between Saucony and Foot Patrol, only in Tokyo. Idea behind these shoes is super dope. Check out the review on my channel to find all the little hits on it. But it just killed it. Saucony Shadow. Saucony, Foot Patrol, and Beams, super dope collab. Next up is one of my favorite sneaker packs that I've ever got, is a collab between Saucony and Premier Skate. One of the first shoes, actually the first shoe, that I ever queued up for, and it is the Shadow 6000. This pack is called the Life on Mars. I guess you can see it with the sort of moon rock gray they got going on there, and the little speckles, very fire. As I said, the first shoot I ever queued up for. And then we have the all red colorway. So some speckles in the midsole, both fire. Still can't decide which one's the best out of the two, but I don't need it to decide because I've got them both. And we've got another Osprey collab. It's called the Stealth. It's in the Shadow 6000. I love these. Another dope kit you can probably get for the low right now. Buttery suede, pattern leather on the toe box, 3M all over the shoe very dope and somehow slept on. Last but not least, I'm gonna show you my Saucony Times Bait Cruel World collection. I believe there has been six shoes that came out. The first pair I didn't cop, wasn't a huge fan of it. I probably should get it to complete the collection, but I'm gonna start with this pair. So this was the Cruel World 2s. Each shoe has its own story about it. I won't go in depth because it will make the video too long. But let's just say all these shoes have a good cause and they donate loads of the profits to charities so salute for this whole bundle. Then we've got the Cruel World Freeze up there with one of my favourites. You've got some crazy ass materials on these. Proper looks like a sock, like proper wool liner going in here. As I said, each shoe has a story. If you do a little Google on the Cruel World Freeze and so on, you find out some dope bits about it. Then we have Cruel World Force. Definitely one of the strangest materials you'll ever feel. It sort of feels like a pair of tracksuit bottoms, basically. It's really mad, but it's a dope colorway. As I said, always supporting this Cruel World thing with Saucony and Bait. Then the Cruel World Fives. A very unique colorway. I believe this had something to do with water from my memory. I did a review of these on my channel, so you can check out all the details on this one. But yeah, so very dark blue. Then we've got this one here, which is sort of like a, a light green almost. Super crazy colorway, Shadow 6000s. Super comfortable, super materials, fire flames. And last but not least, boom, Cruel World 6. Definitely check out the video review of these on my channel. Crazy story about how I ended up getting these. But these are actually a mix between two models of shoes, because they call these the 
5500s for the design so it's not quite shadow 5000 i'm not sure what it was meshed with i can't remember now but i'm sure i mentioned it in my video very dope 3m hits all over it as well fire flames so there we have it my whole Saucony collection no doubt i'll be adding more to that got my eyes on a couple on ebay right now so i need to chill actually because i think that was 27 pairs madness but anywho, hopefully you enjoyed the video. Shout out to all the new subscribers, all the old subscribers, everyone checking out the video. Comment down below if you have any questions about anything, where to cop, etc, etc. Perfection7 is my handle on all my social media. Ashbash signing off. Ladio.